Hey guys, it's Lena Blake from RedefineHorizons.com. We're going to show you how to uh, diagram a website, the basic structure of a website using a, a little online app I found called Write, at, Write Maps. Uh, so I'm, I'm recording this video for Yolanda. She's our new project coordinator and content marketing specialist. So uh, her and I got a lot of website work to do. So I wanted to record this training video for her before I, I hit the sack tonight. Um, my wife is watching The Voice, so hopefully it's not too loud in the background. All right, so here's our website you can see on the screen. Um, it needs some love. Uh, it, it hasn't been updated regularly like we want. So kind of the, one of the first things we're going to do is just get a good kind of diagram of the, the page structure for the website so we can kind of see where we maybe need to reorganize things or fill in the blanks. And just to get to get Yolanda started uh, kind of quickly, we're going to uh, do this in right maps, and then at some point we'll we'll probably kick the diagram over to Inkscape and, and make it look a little, make it look pretty. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go ahead and log in to right maps here, and uh, this is the and th this is a I checked out some different tools, online tools. Uh, this is the the best one I found, and this is just the free version, uh, which is which is a. Uh, Pretty functional, so these guys make a good a good free product available, and then you can upgrade if you want different features. So, so I made a site map here. Uh, it's called RH Main Website. So we're just going to click on that, and then you can see here at the top is the home page, and I've just started adding uh, adding these other pages. So uh, those other pages I've added are are just these top level pages here, which for us are displayed on this menu. Okay, so we've got services about us. Okay, so. Uh, we're just going to click in this box here, left click, and type in learning resources. Okay, so that's this other page here. Okay, then we've got contact us, odds and ends. So we're just working our way across that top bar. Okay, now I got to remember how to add a page. So to add a page, you just come under the box and hit the plus. That adds a new page. And you can click in here and fill it out. So that's contact us. Okay, and then we got odds and ends. Okay, then we got business partners. Okay, then let's see, I think we got, oh, we got two more. Uh, so we got subscribe and privacy policy. And privacy policy. Okay, so that's our top level. That's our top level uh, set of pages there. Okay, <clears throat> so right under home, that's what you can get to it on the home page across the bar. Okay, but then each of these pages will have some pages underneath it, right? So for example, under about us, we have these other pages. Okay, so we have great fit, a great fit, providing value, client testimonials. Okay, so we're just going to add the the, the top three here, just to show you how that works. So we've got about us great fit, a great fit. Okay, so we can click the plus under here. Okay, and we'll say a great fit. Okay, and then we'll add another one here. You can see it just kind of auto expands. Okay, and I forgot what we had. Uh, providing value. got one more client testimonials that we're going to show okay okay now I don't think under any of these pages that we have any sub pages okay oh we do so under you see under our experience we've got another level of sub pages Okay, so we're going to add that, and I'll show you. We'll add another level. So we're going to add another page. This one's called Our Experience. Okay, and then under that, so this is this is level one, level two. This is level three. Okay, now we're going to add some level four pages under here. Okay, so we've got um, project summaries, land surveying, and Stockton farmland surveys. So. Add two more. And surveying in Stockton. Okay, and farmland surveys. Okay, 
So this was level uh, four, right? One, two, three, four. Okay, so we've kind of mapped out our pages now. Um, so I'll, I'm gonna go ahead and have uh, Yolanda's gonna help me map this whole whole site. And there's not as much there as you might worry about. Okay, now the other thing we're gonna do um, is we wanna we wanna go ahead and review each of these pages. So we're gonna just set up a, a, a Trello uh, set get set up to do that in Trello. So let's go ahead and open up Trello. Okay, and I'm gonna come over here to our RH Marketing uh, workspace, and then I think we should have a board for the website. Yep, RH website right here. Okay. All right, so uh, we just got some kind of miscellaneous stuff here uh, for the for the website. So uh, what I want to do is I want to go ahead and add a new. Um, I'm gonna add a new list, and I'm gonna call it Website Audit. call this one to do and then I'm gonna add another one called website add it audit completed okay. and then what we're gonna do is we're gonna we're gonna add a, a template card here so we're gonna call this uh, page audit template okay and we're gonna go uh, just put put some stuff in here okay so we're gonna go ahead and add um, a checklist okay and we're gonna call this audit tasks okay and so we're gonna say uh, check spelling and grammar check for typos check for broken links and then check for internal linking opportunities check for external opportunities okay so I don't I don't I think that's a good list so we're just gonna have you along to go through that um, we might do one more check for updated picture okay so now she can just copy this card when she needs it and we're gonna end up doing that for each uh, page so we're gonna go ahead and create a card here we're just gonna create three Okay, and so we're just gonna start with this first stack here under About Us, okay? So we're gonna make a card for About Us, a great fit and providing value, okay? So we're gonna just rename these, okay? So this is the About Us page. Okay, great fit. a great fit and providing value okay. Okay, and then as she gets these done uh, these pages done she can just drag them over right so she's gonna copy this template make a new card and then she can go in and she she gets these done she can check them off okay and then when they're when they're all checked she can move them over to website auto complete and um, you know what I think I might do is we're just gonna make her a new board and then we'll move these we'll move these over uh, but that'll just give you an idea. She's going to have one of those cards for every page in the uh, uh, the sitemap here that we're building. Okay. By the way, you can switch this to a list view too. Uh, I kind of like this this view a little better. All right. So uh, there you go. It's about ten minutes. That's how long I like to keep these videos. Hopefully that'll help Yolanda as she diagrams our website. And uh, you can use this to to also plan out content for websites. So we'll probably do some of that too in the same app, so I might do another training video on that. So, all right guys, thanks for watching, appreciate it.